Hello everyone and welcome to the new update of Hotelfront property management system. Today I'll show you all the main features such as extended invoice settings, personal database, sales restrictions and stock availability options for deals, booking period settings for booking engine, and new door lock provider. Also passport swiper, and some more improvements. Let's get started. So the first feature is uh, extended invoice settings with more customization. Uh, we go to settings general and selecting the invoice tab. And here we slightly improve the view of the page, the layouts. And also, we added the whole new block of settings down the page. In these settings now, you can customize everything that, that is included in your invoice. All the labels, all the fields, and also currency formats as well, for each of the languages that is enabled in your hotel. Currently, we are looking at the English language, and we can go here and just let's just change some fields. Invoice number and invoice time will be changed for English version of the invoice. And let's save it. We added the option of preview here. And we can see that invoice number and the time of creation is changed. All the fields uh, with some uh, preview data just for convenience uh, available here. So yes, this is a new great feature to customize invoice to your standards and to your needs. A lot of fields to be set. We hope this feature will help a lot in your invoicing. And we are moving on to the next feature, which is personal database. So in a hotel employees module, now by your request, there can be added a new tab called personal database. By default, this table will be empty. This is just a place where you can come where you can display all your employees, whoever has access to the system and also who doesn't have access to the system, just to conveniently have all this information in one place. We have few options to work with this view. First, we can manually add employees to the specific roles. All our roles are displayed here. This is all our standard, role, standard roles and all uh, custom roles we can create in the hotel. And we can just enter any data we need and save it. This is one option. All fields are optional, up to you. And other option is you can quickly import all your employees. They will be grouped by roles, as we can see. And also you can save this page and edit any data. You can select departments, you can select languages, uh, you can select Mr. and Mrs. All this is now available in our system by your request. And we are moving on to the next feature, which is deals, stock and availability and uh, limits and restrictions. So here we are on the deal view, uh, three days for two at the three star hotel in Leipzig. And I already enabled the settings. So first one is stock and availability, which allows us to manage how much of this particular offer we can provide either in general, if this toggle is off or total. 
uh, we have to understand that this quantity cannot exceed the quota of a room type that's selected here. We might take that into account. But yes, now it is possible to manage uh, the inventory of deals. We can also disable this toggle if we don't need any limits and deal can be ordered as much as people get, as people buying it but uh, now this setting is available for us also the sales restriction option this option allows us to enable uh, some limitations for example we want this particular deal to be sold only in this particular sales period and only in, in the days except Monday. So we can set it this way. And for our guests, they won't be able to order this deal for any other time than this time frame. If we do not want any limitations, we can just disable these options and deal will be available at any time frame. But if we need, some deal, some offers are seasonal or some offers uh, happen at the particular time frame, frames in the particular months. This is now available for setting here, nice and convenient. So now we can try and go to the booking engine. We, can, we, have, we have this deal for two nights and two adults. So let's try to find this deal and let's try to book it on Monday, for example. So we are searching. Let's. I I had to search from Monday, so let's search from this time frame, twenty second, twenty fourth, to adults. We can see that we found three deals. Let's see what did we find. You see, we didn't find our deal because we searched for a period that starts from Monday and on Mondays our deal is not available. So now let's search for some other uh, time frame that our deal should be available for. From 24th to 26th. We can see we already found four deals. And this is our deal, so we can order it now. And also, when we ordering this deal, the quota will be also uh, decreasing. If we set just a second, if we set this quota like general limit, when I order this deal, the quota will be decreased. Let's see that. Okay. Let's try to order this deal. Let's skip orders. Select payment method, accept terms and conditions. And let's order this deal. Let's go to the deal page and let's reload the page to see the quota. We can see the quantity decreased. So in this way we can more flexibly manage our deals right now. That's great, let's move on to the next feature. We added a new setting in uh, Room Rates module, uh, which is also available by request. It's Quota Settings, where we can specify custom booking period. What does it mean? We can decide for how long we want our rooms to be sold. It impacts the mean prices and quota on the front desk for the specified amount of months. We have three options here, one year, two years, and three years. So I already preset it for two years as this procedure takes some time to complete. We can now go to the front desk and we can try and check the quota for 2025 two years from now, as we can see, the quota is calculated to this time frame. Also, on our booking engine, 
the guests will be able to book uh, forward for for the time frame that we set on the portal. So now if we try to get to 2025, to the May of 2025, we can see that I can search and I can book rooms or deals for that time frames. As for uh, OTAs, uh, they have their own rules, they have their own limitations, which is one, one and a half years. We don't touch that, we work within that limit. So now it's easy and, um, and cool feature. Let's move on to our next feature. Uh, we added a new provider integration, which is available in settings integrations and it is called Salto SVN. This is a new uh, door lock provider that we have uh, here. So as well as uh, I have Salto door locks in this hotel but uh, you can also uh, consider this option which allows you to encode key cards uh, we have such integration, you can request it. Uh, how this looks, after you integrated this provider and entered all the settings, uh, in your reservations you'll have these keys and you'll be able to manage your log access by re-encoding uh, or cancelling access of your guests. I can see that I have my two guest cards encoded already uh, if cards are not encoded, they will be in red. Nice and simple. So here I can select the guest and I'm encoding for each guest, each key card with my devices. Okay, let's move on to the next feature, which is Passport Swiper. So, for example, uh, we have a guest in the reservation and now with this permission we can easily and quickly enter the guest data by using the password swiper. So, you connecting the password, password reader device to your machine and enabling this action here. Waiting for swipe. The swiper reads all the data of your guests and this data will magically appear here and you won't have to manually type in everything. Okay, uh, that's it for our main features of this release. As always, we always do some minor uh, UI improvements and bugs fixing, so we improved some. Um, layouts in some reports, we increase the maximum time you can set for the services with a duration. Uh, for example, let's see this hot stone massage. We can now set 800, uh, this field to 800 duration of the service, 800 minutes. Before that there was limitation to 300 minutes, now it's gone. Uh, we also fixed some translations, uh, some search on the booking uh, of on creating order reservation, and other minor fixes and improvements. Thank you all for your attention. Goodbye.